So things are a lot different this patch. A lot of items have become harder to get and a lot of barter trades have changed. So in this video, I'll be showing you the best early game barter trades that you can use to gain maximum advantage. I've also shared a relatively less known secret in this video, which is going to help you a lot in your early game. So sit tight and enjoy. Starting from helmet, the 6B47 helmet is available at Ragman level 1 for a barter of 2 bleach, which would cost you only 20k, which I think is a steal deal. The 6B47 is a lot better than the SSH 68 because the 6B47 protects your ears as well for the same cost and it's even cheaper sometimes. Talking about vest, the 6B23 which is a level 3 vest is the best available option at level 1 frapper for a barter of 1 propane tank which would cost you sometimes even low as 20k. The only downside is it is only available once per reset. The armor has very good repair and you should insure this as it has a very high probability of coming back through insurance. The second best option is the UNTAR level 3 body armor at Ragman level 1, available for a barter of 3 max energy drink costing you around 35 to 40k rubles, which is still a better deal than Paka which cost you around 30k which is only a level 2 vest. Coming to rig, at level 1 traders the best available option is the bank robber vest for 10k rubles from Ragman, but if you have level 2 traders unlocked, then the Tarzan rig from Jaeger is the cheapest, available for a barter of one hunting match which typically is available for around 10k rubles, gives you 6 extra slots compared to the bank robber. Talking about bag, in my opinion bags are a must carry, because the more the number of slots in the bag, the more money you can make out of your raid. Now if we look at our options, the best budget bag available would be the MBSS from Peacekeeper level 1 which you can get for a barter of one hard disk which is typically available for only 5 to 10k rubles. A good practice would be to stack a few hard disk in your inventory because sometimes the hard disk cost in flea goes as high up to 20k. Before I move to the most important barter, a few worth mentioning options are if you want to show your dominance from the start, you can get a F1 nade for a barter of one lamp from level 1 frapper. Sometimes you can be lucky to get this for only 10k. Anything more than that would not be worth it. You should always carry some meds with you and a good barter for that is available from level 1 therapist. You can get a car first aid kit for the barter of one humpback which would be a bit cheaper than the regular purchase value of 11,795 rubles. Another amazing barter available is from level 1 Jaeger for a CMS kit, which usually costs 50k rubles but through barter is available for approximately 30k rubles. Now the most important is your weapon. Honestly there is one weapon which stands above all the available options out there and that is the UMP from Peacekeeper level 1, available for a barter of only 7A2607 knife which is easily available every raid from scavs. This knife is available at flea for only 4k which makes the weapon costing you only 28k. Now I am going to share a trick that only a few know of and since you guys are watching till here then you definitely deserve to know. In case you don't have your flea unlocked, you can still get the knife from fence for around 4.5k and here is how. All you have to do is go to fence and select melee and you can buy the knives from here. This option is not available when buying knives through flea market. So make sure you are looking here as well. The UMP is such a good choice because of its low recoil and easy modding. You don't have to get any attachments and you can just put them on when you find them in raid. I hope this video was helpful to you to gain that extra advantage in your raid. And if this was helpful, don't forget to drop a like for the algorithm and comment if you have any questions. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one. Uh, yeah.